We went to the border to look at the river to see where the refugees would be crossing from Central African Republic into Cameroon. As we waited, we saw from far away these refugees in such dignity walking across the river, wading across the river to safety in, uh, in Cameroon. We saw very sick people. We saw what looked like swollen knees until you realized that it was children and men who were so malnourished after walking for months um, with just leaves and uh, bad water to drink. So you saw how thin they became and therefore their knees looked swollen, but in fact many it was just that the muscle had been lost. We saw people who had bullet wounds in different parts of their bodies. We saw some children and adults who had machete wounds, and all of them spoke about losing people along the way, their family, their friends being killed, their, their cattle being poisoned or shot, and they talked about uh, sleeping at night in fear of the militias that were chasing them, and then how they would walk during the day searching for anything to eat. It was something that even a very seasoned humanitarian couldn't help but be moved by. We saw children, many, many of the children coming across with severe conjunctivitis. Luckily it's treatable, but very annoying, especially after walking for so long. Um, and it just shows the lack of hygiene uh, available to these refugees as they fled for their lives.